wow, I look like an alien with eye enlarging contacts in and no like eye makeup. My eyelashes, my natural eyelashes are pretty much non-existent. Anyways, hello everyone, it's Koneko here and today's video is going to be a mall haul. I mainly got some stuff from Claire's, but I also picked up something from Sephora and ended up getting something something at uh, Cineplex when we went to see Aquaman yesterday. So I'm actually going to start with the item that I got from Sephora because I'm going to finish up this look um, right now uh, so that I can stop looking kind of a little bit dead, a little bit creepy, I don't know what's going on. But anyways, the first item that I picked up is this cute Christmas box from Too Faced. I got it at Sephora. Um, there was one on display and this was the last box there. They were sold out of a lot of their um, Christmas special palettes and whatnot. Uh, originally $52 and I believe it was on for like 32 or 27 or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, so I grabbed it um, and I was just looking for an eyeshadow palette. But when I got home, I was like, oh, cool. <laughs> There's three different parts and a mini mascara to the mascara. Like I already have a big version of this, um, but it's awesome to have travel size items. And on the back, I was like, oh, the top part is highlighter, bronzer, and blush. And then there's two eyeshadow palettes. The middle one has eight exclusive shades and the bottom one has 10 exclusive shades. And it says all like the names of them on the back here and uh, what's in like the ingredients for them all. I've been lucky and even though I have sensitive skin, I haven't had any like weird reactions to makeup. So you open it like this. And it looks like a cute pink Christmas tree with gold detailing, lots of stars and some like string. It says Too Faced up here and a star at the top. And it's velvety, which I had no idea till I opened it up because I didn't touch the one on display. I was just like, that's a good deal. I'm gonna grab it. I need more makeup supply stuff. And then there's a mini Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. And like I said, I have the bigger version of this but it's always good to have travel size makeup. Yeah, it's just a mini mascara. Good for six months. I love the detailing here with the gold, the little mouse, and the squirrel. I'm just gonna take out each set. So when you take one away, they're each going to be triangles left. It just, it feels so nice. And on this little plastic piece, you've got Angel Kiss, Winter Glow, Christmas Flush. The second bit here, again, it's kind of like <laughs> how it looks in there when you take each step out. So you've got Vanilla Snow, Christmas Wish, Kiss for Santa, Rockin' Around, Dream It, Believe It, Christmas morning, cozy up to Christmas, and wishful thinking. The inside is cute with little bunnies and says Too Faced. I really like the style of this. And the last bit has the little end for the tree. Super cute. I actually wasn't sure if it was part of the box or not, but it looks like it's not. So for this eyeshadow palette, we have Beard of White, although it looks like a beigey color. <laughs> Winter Wonderland, Pleasant Dreams, Dream Come True, Unicorns Pull My Sleigh, Oh What Fun, Wishes and Kisses, Starlight, Fresh Cut and Frosty, Under the Mistletoe. So there's three here that are very shimmery and this one's a little bit shimmery. So these are the items that came in the box. And now I'm going to finish up my makeup. <laughs> I'll just go into the Christmas blush. I don't wear blush that often. And this is definitely like not 
really a proper brush for this, but I didn't bring all my brushes over here and I don't feel like getting up and and getting my other brushes. This is fine, I don't want too much on anyways. I don't even know if it'll show up in the camera. Um, what's the top one again? Angel Kisses? I wonder what that's. You can kind of see some shine. Okay, <laughs> I'm mainly here for like the eyeshadow so that I can finish up my eyeliner and put on my fake lashes. So what do I want to go with today? I'm wearing uh, contact lenses from Honey Color in the color Wine by Super Pinky. Just because I'm testing them out for another video. I'm gonna dip into, I think, I don't know if I should go for darker or lighter. I might play around with Pleasant Dreams Starlight and uh, Unicorns Pull My Sleigh because I really like adding the glitter in there but I probably won't cut my crease today because that's a lot of effort. Alright, so darkening my crease. I Like, I can't remember these names. People, Pleasant Dreams. I like dark colors and then I never know if they suit me though. I do love this color though. It's kind of like a deep plum, maybe. I don't know. I only went to art school, no big deal. It's only been recently that I've really like experimented with makeup, so I'm like really not that good, but I'm trying. I'm trying. Yeah, I think that works pretty well. I'm going to take this brush, it just says Sephora on it, so I don't really know all the fancy terms for my brushes, but I'm going to take that dark color and just go under a little bit over here. But okay, I'm going to stop the get, try to move along the get ready with me part <laughs> here because this is supposed to be a haul video, but I did want to try the makeup, so I'm just gonna quickly finish up my makeup. Looking better. <laughs> my lashes are from Sephora. I didn't get them this time, but they're swanky number 33. So I'm going to be doing some cosplay and cosplay pictures, so that's why I was like, I might as well finish my makeup during this video. <laughs> Much better. I don't know, I just love long eyelashes. They're just so pretty. And like, it just adds, doesn't it? <laughs> okay, okay. I gotta get on to this haul. One more lash to go, and I think I'm good. I am now an Ewok. Okay. Enough of that nonsense. Where was I? So, then we went to, well, first we stopped at one of those like phone case booths and I grabbed a new phone case because I had my favorite color which was like a light greenish, like mint green color, but it just got dirty so easily and I was like, okay, even if I get cute phone cases in the future. I want one that I can wear daily and it won't get dirty as easily or you won't be able to tell so I picked up a black case um, and it's nice and smooth and simple and soft um, and then of course I needed to replace my very dirty donut pop socket and I went to Spencer's they didn't have much left um, I guess they just kind of sold out 
kind of a good gift to put in like stockings and stuff. Anyways, so I went to Claire's and she was like, hi, we have buy three, get three things free. And I was like, oh, okay. Where are your pop sockets? <laughs> and so I looked and this was the only one that had black here because my donut pastel one had white on the side and from like makeup and stuff and so like I would do my makeup and like take pictures and like even if I would like try to wash my hands like I just would get makeup all over my phone and so it was really gross but now I have a black one so like I could be gross and like you probably won't be able to see it <laughs> um but it's simple and cute and yeah I I really like it it it's uh my darker fashion style that I've been trying to like do more of um, or like online for my cosplay with like my backup cosplay account is koneko.studios but I want it to kind of be like where I show like makeup looks that I practice with and like maybe different fashion styles that I try like trying to, to make cool outfit looks um, like Taylor R is one of my big inspirations for both kind of like YouTube and like vlogging stuff and also for like her fashion sense and whatnot. So pop socket first thing. Also grabbed this super cute headband with these floofers on it. I always wanted a pair of these and I was like ah, I could make them I have some plain headbands that I'm not doing anything with and I have like pom-poms but like I really don't have floofers like this like these floofers <laughs> and they're just super cute and they kind of like look like little ears and with my floofy hair I just kind of feel like an Ewok they had uh, this color and gray and like a weird rosy pink or something. Uh, I went with these because I thought they would go with like lots of stuff and like red and black, look good, hair, mmm. So, and then, um, these were actually so cheap that we just got them on their own. So, pop socket was one buy. Then there's this makeup bag since I am getting tons more makeup and into makeup and stuff. Um, I have like a plastic container that I keep some makeup in and like some really kind of like cheap plain makeup bags. Um, not that these are super amazing quality, it is from Claire's, but super adorable and like pastel and space. See, there's like constellations on here and it's kind of holographic and the zipper has little stars and yeah it's like a good size for like makeup stuff it's very roomy inside just just plain but you know you could stack some like palettes and bigger things in there and then I have this smaller one here which says donut give up Amazing <laughs> and like look at the holographic and the donuts. I am obsessed It is beautiful Oh The only thing is is these zippers should have been like little silver donuts But you know you can't have it all Handle is really thick sturdy material and like a little bit squishy which speaking of squishies so in there, it's just plain, but pushing, squishy, donut, square thing. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. <laughs> oh, being an adult is great. So super cute square donut pink icing pastel circle sprinkles little machine with its booty in the back so squishy and so like smooth to touch <laughs> like it's so good A little chain keychain thing like how can you not like squish 
squishies. Like it's just so, I'm gonna stop now. <laughs> okay, so remember this guy? Well, there was also a mini book bag. And I actually saw this last time we were at the mall, which isn't very often, which is probably good because just like all the cute things, I want them. Um, but yeah, so I finally got this little iridescent silver donut book bag. So awesome. There's a front zipper, very sturdy material, decent size pocket. It's got pocket on either side there. Don't think I could fit like a water bottle or anything, but then the main bit here. Lots of room, sturdy, it like stays up on its own, it doesn't like collapse. Like I love this material, it just feels really good. And then adjustable straps in the back here, little doodad. It's just so cute. Like, tell me this isn't amazing. Don't, don't say it's not amazing, cause it is. Okay, so then we have a donut pillow. Just because this one, unlike my other donut pillow, does not have a face, but it fits in with all my donut themes and like, I need to start streaming some more and show all my donut stuff in the background and be like, very donut connecto connecto y Could that be my thumbnail? <laughs> so it's like shiny material, a little bit stiffer material, not exactly soft but very cute and pastel. These bits are more soft for the sprinkles, variety of color, and it's very soft and squishy, plushy like in the back there. And like it's perfect donut color, it's not too yellow. Like this, yeah, there's some like yellow, but there's also like blue donuts and stuff. Like that's whatever, but sometimes you get donut items. Like even this is almost like too yellow, but not quite, it's pretty good. Yeah, I just, I like it to look more like a freshly baked donut. <laughs> and then, we went to see Aquaman, which was awesome. He's like, I think he's my new favorite now. Like, wow, that was a good movie. Anyways, we were going to get some snacks and I saw this guy, he was so cute. And I was like, I just need to touch him because he looks super soft and squishy and he is. He reminds me of the mochi type um, plushies that I've gotten in like other things like, yeah. This guy, this guy is actually squishier that I got from like China or something in my sponsorship box thing. But this is close and pretty much just as soft. And her little tail back here. <laughs> and they're called squishamals, squishamallows. So soft, cuddle and squish me. You got it. Um, I named her Mira after Mira from Aquaman. <laughs> and she sat on my lap and I cuddled and squished her <laughs> while we watched the movie. I was thinking like like over halfway through it or something or like two hours in, I was like, wow, this is a long movie. I'm so glad because like it covered so much stuff and so detailed and was so epic. Um, it deserved to be that long. It was like two and a half hours or something. I don't know the official like time, but like we were like roughly in there for that long. But yeah, so these are the items from my mall haul of stuff. Uh, the mall was open later because of the holidays and there were sales going on because of that. Uh, I obviously did not really need most of this except for in my opinion the phone case and pop socket I just find um well these ones are are sturdier for drop I drop my phone a lot and uh I like holding this it just makes it more convenient for me and yeah I mean I fit stuff for my makeup and whatnot but if you liked this video please give it a big thumbs up so that I know that you liked it and let me know if you would like to see more haul videos or 
um, if I should mix up videos, maybe kind of do a bit more chatting, like I kind of started to chat there about random stuff, um, and then mix in the haul a bit more, or like how I kind of got ready during the video, maybe I can do more of that. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. As always, I'll leave all the links to everything in the description box below. If you'd like to know when I post another video, because I don't have a super specific schedule, except for that I usually post on Wednesdays or Saturdays or both, um, click the little bell icon to be notified when I do post. You can follow me on Twitter at Koneko Dolls. I think there's an S at the end. I just recently changed it um, from Koneko IRL. Um, and my whenever I upload, it goes directly to Twitter, so you'd be notified that way as well. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.